Welcome back to another episode of Ratchet and Clank Going Commander Developer Commentary. I am Tony Garcia. And I am Mike Stout. <laughs> and uh, we're going back to Planet, Planet Grelvin, and we're going to finish off the Hypnomatic section. And uh, I think this is our second to last bit. We do this, and we got the end of the game, and There's then... One uh, more level, yeah. And we're doing it all without armor. I'm kind of, I kind of want to not get armor at this point. Let's just see if you can man through it. But the, I know the last level is really hard. Uh, the enemy section to get to the boss is pretty difficult. And I think armor is just what the doctor ordered, so... Well, we could do... I mean, because, yeah, no weapon is really going to put us over the... No maybe weapon's going to be much bang. Maybe the shield charger, but I would go with the armor. Where's the armor vendor? Was there an armor vendor here? There was. Because we, this is where we saw the Carbonox armor. Oh, it was past. Was it, in the it was segment? in here. Oh, okay. There it is. We are jerks. That is pretty. We are just jerks. Uh, so do it. Get the dirt. Let's play. make it happen. Let's go with it. Dude, you're looking pretty slick now. I just wanted to see that UI again. Ricardo worked very hard on this UI. Yeah. By the way, we haven't been talking too much about the UI because. It's sort of it's, what happens when you work on UI that nobody will ever talk about it unless, unless you do it's it badly. broken. Yeah. The hallmark of a good UI is nobody notices you did your job. Yeah, and that's kind of sad. Because you know, but well, on the other on uh, uh, on the other side, nobody gives a shit for snow beasts. So. <laughs> receiver bot has a blaster attack. Press circle to shoot enemies. To exit the robot, press triangle. Oh wait, this is th that was a little bit wrong. Circle actually lets me hypnotize another enemy. Really? Not attack. Oops. Ah, uh, oh. Can you just jump, jump your way through this segment, or do you have to? Well, he has no oh. life. So it's a matter of time, more than anything else. Right. Well, also the the only things, the only ones you can hypnotize have the, the right. dishes on them. You know, it kind of, it's that corner is what's screwing me back there. Because I have to turn the camera before I can get the hit. Back. Oh yeah. Look at that. Wow, 90 degree turn. That's a pretty bitch move. Ooh, synthonites. You're kind of running out of weapons. You can uh, shoot an ape. Oh, oh! Oh, oh! <laughs> I, thought I, I thought I was saved. <laughs> <laughs> that is my favorite. Oh man, that was brilliant. That was bloody brilliant. I, I can't even blame you for that, can I? No, not really. I don't think I. I mean, this is. Uh, so, I don't know who did it, this stuff. Well, well that was. All the, yeah, yeah, yeah. All the stuff, yeah. Blame design. Blame design. That's what I want to do. I'm sorry you hypnotized that guy. How's this? Is this fun? Uh, it's a inter it's it's very time based, which is interesting. It's fun to watch and watch things blow up. It's a bit weird because there's no uh, there's no danger of me dying by any of the enemies. So the whole challenge is. In is in the speed. This is our first underwater gameplay. Right. We haven't done well, any underwater the, gameplay. Well, there was a little bit in... Uh, in the Thermator section. But yeah. yeah. And in, the, in, in level four. That was where the first time we ever used it. There was supposed to be a ton because of that gadget that got cut. But there you go. This is pretty empty, too. Platinum bolt. Is that? No, you have to find Angela. Yeah, still. I'm still going the right way. Okay, I, this I must have just gone secret. a secret way. 
without knowing. Without knowing. Thinking it was the critical path. I like how we just gave you the O2 mask uh, this time through. Without you having to earn it? Yeah. yeah. I think that was the pro move. Isn't this... Return to the surface. I went all the way through, and now I'm going to come oh, up on the other okay. side. Say what's up to Angela. You know, I remember back uh, on the forums, I got um, a message that I thought was pretty funny uh, about somebody. I guess there was somebody on, her for on their forums who had a friend named Angela. And uh, she sent me a message, like, very upset that apparently her friend was claiming that we had named the Angela character after her. And she was like, is this true? Did you name a character after her? I was like, I don't think that's what we did. I mean, maybe we did. I don't think so. <laughs> uh, I don't remember that. Well, it was a private message. I didn't share it with anybody. Oh, okay. I keep my private messages private, Mike. Um, what about that little motorcycle? Is that where, or you have to go up to that door? Or... This was... Oh, yeah, yeah, I just go up to the door. Yeah, I should have just... Walked right up. Hey, nice digs. Yeah, it's a little remnant from my previous life. You were reincarnated? She's so tall. Oh, no. She is very tall. My Megacorp days. They've got a very generous bonus package. Uh, right. So now that you've got your ID badge, I can rest you some care. She's like, yeah, 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 I care. <laughs> Mommy, where do proto pets come from? Why, they come from Megacorp, dear. That's right, Mrs. Robot. All of the protopets in the galaxy come from right here in our factory. I love how so much of the stories of the early Ratchet games were just them bumbling from place to place <laughs> so that they could find... So that they could find out where they had to go next, you know what I mean? It's like, man, we don't know where the bad guy is. Let's just go here. And shoot some stuff with rockets, and then maybe we'll get one. You can answer with confidence. They come from Megacorp. That factory is using the original protobet to produce all the others. Exactly. If we can take out the original protopet, that'll shut them down permanently. Twenty percent off a complete service at Groovy Lube. Oops. <laughs> Wrong one. This will deactivate the door to the protopet duplication area. I'll meet you there. Sure you want to swim. That joke no, fell a little flat. I do I do appreciate the, the groovy loop message. Because that was a, th a throwback to the first game, but uh, Or what no, it was a throwback to the first scene of this game. Is this where you're supposed to go? I don't think so. Just looking around. Probably should be able to do that. What's that then? This will take me back down. This is a taxi. Oh no! Oh no! It's oh, this the is ship. a this is the ship that makes it, this level easier. Yeah. So we, we give you a ship, and people still complained. What a bunch of complainers! Oh, it tells you where the Raritanium is. And what do they have anything to complain about? We give you a ship. Does it shoot? No. <laughs> I think that's why they complain. This is weird. Oh, but this doesn't give you the crystals. This is just mine, for raritanium. It, mine, it mines crystals. Oh. No, yeah, just for raritanium. It's a different thing. Mm. This is weird. I don't remember this. There's one of these in uh, in the desert level too. People complain about everything. We gave them a ship, and they're still complaining about the level. A bunch of ones. Oh! Ah! Oh! Oh! Ah! I think they're complaining about the snow bees raping them to death. Jesus! Come on! Alright, here we go. Now I'm back. I'm back in control. What are you doing? Inside? Getting the crystals, because they're here. I'm, I'm on my way back anyway. I saw this crystal and I felt an urge to break this. 
But that led me to have to fight other things. To sadness. Was that a little fuck you hole that opened up right there? Oh, no, 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 no. That's just a spawner. A snow bee spawner? Yeah. Okay, so you can't fall in it. No. Okay. So you can't fall. No. Oh, come on. Die, you sons of bitches. Alright, back to the hippie. Oh, they're moonstones. Right. On this level. Oh, are the crystals here? That was a short uh, trip back to Grelvin. But well worth it. But you know what? There was a lot of excitement there at the end. <laughs> at the end. Uh, yeah, that worked out. We even got a little groovy, groovy loop joke. Yeah. You know what? It's, it's like a crotchetizer joke. It, it wouldn't be a ratchet game without a groovy loop. Man, I, really, I want to really just go back out there. I really just... Do I it. Wanna, no, I can't. Go. I can't. We, we're, we oh, gotta you know, go... That sounds like you're <laughs> talking out of turn. We got we got a we got another we got a level to do here and right. you know okay all right let's go you know what if I went back out in, into the into the frozen wastes I would make people feel bad because I would be amazing at it and they'd be like oh well uh, you know it's hey, you don't want to make people feel bad <sighs> it's not my it's not my goal maybe someday I like how the plane moves up when you get close to it so it doesn't that's pretty pro you. isn't it what was there a snow beast down here. There's Snoopy's everywhere. Why are you so like I like that they're down there just still swiping at me. Like, just come on down here, Ratchet. <laughs> <laughs> we got something for you. <laughs> go, my, go, my Synthanoid army. I like that. That creates some tension. It's like, do I really want to go down there? And they're like, yes, I really do want to go down. Nice! Ooh, look at that. See? That was fun. So are you done? They don't. They don't let up. I am done. I thought that was funny though. But I'm done. There's still snow bees down there. There are always snow bees down there. <laughs> That's the theme of this level. It's like it? you know what this was like. It's you know that movie Tremors. It's like that movie Tremors where they're like on the rocks, but they know the guy, the things are around there. Probably nobody sees this. Probably knows about the movie Tremors. No, I like Tremors. Tremors was a million years ago, dude. So, uh, for Rash and Clank, going commander developer commentary, I'm Tony Garcia. And I have no idea what Tremors is. <laughs> we'll see you next time.